Bridge Open is uh, one of my favorite tournaments and one of the biggest tournaments and you always aim for it. So uh, yeah, I'm happy to, to, to play in the glass court and uh, I'm really looking forward to this week and uh, I hope uh, it's going to be on my side. Especially when you've been put under pressure or playing someone as tricky like Shabini so deceptive it's hard to really get you get a rhythm consistently especially when you're playing somebody like Shabini you don't want to give her an inch of confidence but also you want to respect her but not too much and almost let the story unfold oh well I got the lead but then she caught up and, and she's supposed to win therefore yeah. she is if she could stick to that and try and replicate that every single rally which is difficult I know especially against someone like Shabini Right onto the racket. 11, eight. Bit of Game awareness required Shabini. there from Sobi in that front right hand corner again. Again, it's that shoulder height for El Shabini. There it is. To Shabini. She's, uh, to be honest, she's way better than her ranking now, and uh, she's playing really good this season. And uh, it's very tough to play against her in the second round. Maybe not the best squash I played, but uh, but happy that I digged in and uh, get the second game. Well, here we're seeing the retrieval abilities of Gina Kennedy. Oh, that's quality. Terrific attacking play from El Shabini. She's got that quality in the lockup. She steps up the court here. She's not hanging around. The body language has changed in that third game, but now she's really kind of reeling in the reins of touch. She's not allowing El Shabini to control that middle of the court. Fearless into that backhand front corner, and well, it's a great boast, though, isn't it? It is because she was in a really compromised position there. Thick backhand corner is a great Six, shot from Kennedy. Nine. Six match balls to book her place into her third consecutive British Open semi final. Oh, what a terrific effort and full credit to Gina Kennedy, nine, played her part 11, 5, 11, 4, 9, in a 11, terrific first 11, women's quarter final here. Gina is playing uh, incredibly well uh, this season and uh, as you said it's totally different than the last two meetings and uh, yeah, everyone is improving and everyone is watching the other opponents and uh, yeah, I think she, she was doing great today and uh, happy I, I took a Huge leap in each game I won, so maybe this is, uh, this is what made the difference at the end. What a shot that is from Shabini. I mean, who needs confidence when you've got those racket skills? 7-4. Oh, it's good hands from Sobi. What a rally. Oh, she's played it. Oh! Oh, my oh, word, she, she got it. it! No, she didn't. She did! No, she didn't! She did! She did not! <laughs> oh, that's a joke shot. That is an outrageous shot. She launched that on the backhand side. Seven. With the right hander. Check this out. Impressive. Movement starting to go. It's good parrying here from Sobi, but she's really, really finding the movements tough. Oh, well played. Very, very, very subtle, very clever. Look at that. Dry smile.
They look down, Shabini's pulled it off. 11-6, match to Shabini, three games What a battle two. between these two. I was sure it's gonna be a tough match, like last time she beat me, and uh, I was 100% sure it's gonna be a tough match, not an easy one. And uh, yeah, all respect to her and what she was has doing this season. She's been uh, playing amazing and uh, pushing all the top uh, players, and uh, she's one of them, obviously. So uh, yeah, I'm just uh, happy that uh, I won today. that she needs the time that's been taken but also checking her movement all the time Gohar's movement that is and she's not having her own way with the flow of this match so far so these are the sort of questions that we're really interested to see how Gohar responds to this because we know she's a champion that's, that's phenomenal <laughs> I just it's just brilliant so good I was gobsmacked in that rally to be honest Again. Oh, slingshot, slingshot. Seven, seven. to Shabini. Warrior Princesses. Shabini leads two games. Pressing on them. here. This is beyond impressive from her. It's just so unexpected, isn't it, from her? She just doesn't expect to ever be 2 0 down against anybody in a major final. I mean, it just goes in again. Just Too out. low. They're like arrows. Nine championship ball. balls to win a fourth British Open title. Oh, the Warrior Princess has done it. She's won a fourth British Open title here in Birmingham. An absolute masterclass from her. Brilliant. Unbelievable, eh? You know, we all have to take our hats off or possible hair pieces. Absolutely brilliant for Nora El Shabini. Broken the Terminator. She's broken the world number one. Another major title to her resume. Let's hear it for your British Open champion 2023, Nora El Shabini.